Hey guys, it's Marlo back again with another NECA review for you guys. And today I have the Gremlins Ultimate Flasher Gremlin. Found this at my local Target store. I know he's been out for a while, but I've never seen him in stores. So just glad to finally get my hands on him. So a quick view of the nice artwork there on the box. The side of the box. There has been a... NECA Flasher Gremlin released before, which I have in the collection, but that version had uh, plastic uh, accessories such as the trench coat, so it wasn't as uh, detailed or realistic as this one. More images here of the product inside. If you want to, just pause the video to read all that. And you can see here some of the accessories that come with the figure. Nothing much at the top, you can see little warnings there. And at the bottom we have the credits for the talents involved with the making of this great figure, as well as the UPC, if you guys are curious. So moving on, we have a flap door, just like all the ultimate NECA figures we've been uh, accustomed to. So with the flap door you get the Velcro that holds it in place and a nice product image once again inside. And you can see the figure there with all of the accessories looking pretty cool. Again, this is a soft goods trench coat as opposed to the previous release, which was pretty much fixed with a more plastic or sort of rubberized trench coat. So this is really a nice improvement over that as well as, you know, with the figure being a lot more articulated and detailed. So anyways, let's get him out of the package and see how cool he really is out of the box. And here we have the Flasher Gremlin out of package, and for this figure, wow, he is just loaded with accessories. So at this point, we're pretty much just getting these Gremlins for the different accessories, it seems, at this point. Uh, we have the uh, Fedora hat back there, which is pretty cool looking. And hopefully this will place on top of his head okay without uh, sliding off too much. We have the big beer mug here and if you wanted to I guess you can empty it out and just have an empty beer mug as well let me put this back in put the beer back in there but uh, you know otherwise you can have a full mug we have this sock puppet type thing it's hollow underneath so you can place that over one of the hands I suppose you just need to pop the hand off and then insert the puppet over the remaining portion of the arm. Uh, we have a bunch of uh, poker and gambling accessories here, some cards and chips, some extra playing cards there, uh, dealer's visor or I don't know what you call this, cap or whatever, uh, the mallet, uh, a bunch of cigarettes, these are individual cigarettes, a little, uh, what do you call this, a bow tie, and let's see some shades and an extra hand there so we only get one extra hand this is for the right side and uh, yeah you can see all of these accessories there to recreate various scenes from the movie and uh, yeah if you don't just want to have a flasher gremlin you can have a poker playing gremlin i don't know you can have a beer drinking gremlin all kinds of options with all of these accessories and I believe they show that at the back of the package let me give you guys a preview or a look at that again you can have them there with the mallet drinking the beer playing with the puppet you know acting as a dealer there for uh, some gambling scenes so a ton of options with this figure and if you've seen any of the Ultimate Gremlins before, they're pretty much exactly the same. Not going to bother with all the articulation points. You can see the trench coat. So for the first time, we get a nice soft goods fabric trench coat. I'll try to insert a photo of the older version that had a plastic or rubberized trench coat for comparison. Let's see if I can do that I'll put the figure there yeah hopefully I can drop a photo next to this guy but uh, yeah not much else to talk about except for you know the various options that you have with the accessories 
I'll try to I'll try to take a few shots to uh, show you at the end of the video some of the uh, uh, different options that you can recreate with the accessories much like what you see there so that's more or less it guys I hope you guys enjoyed the video if you did please give the video a thumbs up oh wait hold on a second hold on I'm almost forgetting let me do a quick comparison I just did a review on the summer games gremlin so you can see they're quite similar the heads are probably just a little different because this is obviously striped with the uh, white hair at the top of the head there but the bodies should be pretty much the same otherwise I have this guy standing up a little bit more upright uh, I'll try to get the trench coat off so let me show you guys real quick actually <clears throat> Oh, that gets undone pretty easily and you can see the body underneath is pretty much similar to what we see in the other figures so again just more gremlins there for the collection uh, you know stay tuned to the end of the video for the photos and that's it I hope you guys enjoyed the video like I said keep on collecting guys subscribe if you haven't already and I will see you all next time. Bye-bye.